Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna, aka Hook by Brianna. And today I wanted to do like an inspiration type video and just to show y'all different like crochet pieces that we can make for the spring and summer. So I compiled like a list of pieces that I thought were cute and that I would make. And this is also a way that y'all can see how I get my inspiration and where I get my inspiration from. And yeah, all the ones that I wanted to include in this video, I wanted to actually like make it so you are able to actually crochet it. So all of them have a pattern or a tutorial and I will have those links in the description down below for you guys so you can actually make it and not just see, oh my gosh, that's so pretty, but how do I even make it? So yeah, let's go ahead and get right into this video. So first up, here are some tutorials and patterns for bottoms. First up, we have this pattern by me. I just released it today, so go ahead and check that out. Um, it's more like cover-up pants, and they are flare pants. Then we have this retro-looking skirt. I think it would be really cute with bright summer colors or even pastels for the spring. Then we have this skirt with the singe in the middle. I think it would be super cute just to wear as a skirt or even as a cover-up when you go to the beach or something. And here is an actual beach cover up, which I think is really cute. I love the like see-through lacy type thing it has going on and the fringe on the side. And then this granny square skirt, which is perfect for summer and spring. Next up, we have crochet dresses. So this one is like a wavy type dress and I think it's super cute for the summer. And then this long dress, I think it is so pretty and I love the different like cutouts it has and the length of it. Next up is the longest category, which is tops. Next up we have this flower top, which I think is really different, and it has like a little hoop in the middle, and it looks like a flower, obviously. I like it because it's kind of like the butterfly top, but everybody's making that now, so I think this one is different and still cute. I actually use this as the top of my brown gown that I made recently, so yeah. Now we have this top. I think it is so cute and trendy. I love the sleeves and the little tie in the middle of it just to give it shape. Then we have this bralette slash top made out of like stripes and granny squares. I think it's perfect for in this color of the spring and as well as summer colors for the summer. Then we have this more conservative top. It's not like a bralette like the previous ones are, but it is long sleeve like and that has a tie in the middle that I really like and yeah. And then we have this tank top with the tie in the middle, of course. It does have the shell stitch, which is really pretty for the springtime. Then we have this trendy bralette top. I really like the crisscross and the ring in the middle, and I think it's really simple yet different. And here's just a perfect cardigan for the spring and summertime. It's not too warm. It's a light type, and I love the colors. Next up, accessories. So we have this tote bag. I love the like flowery designs and I think in a sage green that would be perfect for the spring. Then we have this bag. I love like the colors on the sides and the white in the middle. I will probably make this for myself sometime over the summer. And then we have this tie-dye bucket hat. Of course you can make just a solid color or stripes or something that would be pretty cool. But yeah, it's great for the summertime. And last but not least, we have our honorable mentions. They're here because either they don't have a tutorial or a pattern or they got deleted. So I'll just show y'all what they are and maybe you can try to freehand it or make a tutorial for yourself on it. Or you can always just take these as inspiration, which is the purpose of this video, and make your own design based off of whatever you see that you like. So this one recently has gone viral. I'm sure you've seen it before, but I just had to put this in the video. This one is here because of the lacy detailing on the skirt and it's just so different and pretty. And then we have this tote bag. I love it. It's just the tutorial got deleted off of YouTube. And then this one, it was just on my Pinterest. I have no clue what it's called or who made it, but I just love the look of it. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I know it's a little different 
and you didn't see my beautiful face this whole video but you did see some beautiful crochet pieces that you can actually make this spring slash summer so make sure you follow me on instagram subscribe comment down below if you like this type of video and i would love to make this for all of the different seasons or just whenever i find cute pieces and i just want to make another inspo video but peace and happy crochet